instructor Jake here, and folks, it is another fun day at Sea for you today. Mm -hmm. Lots of great fun happening throughout the day. Coming up in just 15 minutes, come and join myself and Brandon and Gabby from the Fun Squad. Good morning from day two. Another day at sea, we're gonna go down to the Lido, get our chairs, and then we're gonna head to the buffet. Don't really remember what's on the docket for today, what we have planned. So we're gonna have a relaxing day and take it easy. So stick with us. Okay, here's what I got for breakfast. I got this cappuccino Eggs. chocolate chip muffin. I need Salmon Benedict, that. peanut butter, fruit. Mm -hmm. What'd you get, Mal? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> this is a cappuccino chocolate muffin. Oh, that sounds good. Pancake, good. waffles. I got dry cereal because I didn't see any almond or like oat oh. milk or anything. What is that, Lucky Charms? Yeah, and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Oh. <laughs> Folks, for all the rest of the fun, make sure to check out the Carnival Hub app and the fun times, it's all there for you. And if you're still looking to book your short excursion for tomorrow at St. Martin, it is not too late. The Carnival Adventure Desk is open for you. You can also book your excursions through the Carnival Hub app. And as I previously mentioned, I do highly recommend you get yourself on a Carnival short excursion so you make the most of your time out in port. Folks, have a wonderful afternoon out there. I'll be back a little bit later on this early evening to let you know. Okay, let's go play some trivia. But I'll see you for guest that group. Upstairs in 10 minutes on the Lido deck, but until then, Jake it easy. Okay, Jake, thanks a lot. Jake it easy, baby. Right, head to the casino it. and head over to the trivia. All right, we're gonna play Celebrity Trash, and we have to guess what is in the celebrity's trash can. No, we guess who the celebrity is. Oh, yeah, the other way around. Backwards. Guess the celebrity by their trash. Got it. And a poster yep. of a chameleon wearing a Hawaiian shirt. This one. <laughs> yep. Yes, Johnny. Who's actor is Hush? A weapon that freezes things into solid ice. Oh, and army uniform covered in blow and dot in the dog's yeah. blood. Arnold. And a turbo yep. and dog. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> I can't. A weapon that freezes did you have to put a mailman to get it? Pretty much. My brother had to go through hell to get it for me. I got it for Adam. A jumpsuit with a name, we attended Rippling on it. 13 different wedding rings. And a paranormal refrigerator. All right, we won. Look at that. Look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. We got them all right, 20 for 20, plus a bonus point. A tiebreaker. No tattoos this time, honey. Yep. Seafood shack. Right, look at this. This looks delicious. Yeah. What's this? Bronzino, a snapper, a lobster. Oh, look at these oysters. Oh, yeah. Well, we grabbed a smorgasbord of stuff. Let's go try this. So the reason why we didn't go to the seafood place is because the fry later was down. No signage anywhere. We're yeah, in even, line. We were in line for a while. Yeah, we were in line for a good five, and ten minutes. And they said it's been closed all morning. And they said it's been closed all morning. So they already knew. And then they told us when we were pretty much up there. So They should have a sign. Th there should have been something out there to kind of signify that. So one thing I noticed about this is like service is a little bad. Touch and go. But we're gonna enjoy our dessert. And we'll get back to you. All right. What's the synopsis on the That's honeycomb good. cake? Good. Yeah, I like that. It's rich. <laughs> Let's try the German chocolate cake. Go like that. Mmm. Oh yeah. I love that. And that's uh, red velvet. That's good. Coconut chocolate cake. Light on the frosting. I think walnuts are in there too. That's right up my alley. Mmm. The red velvet is mid.
is not special. Oh. However, the chocolate one in the coffee cake is very good. Okay, we made it to Guy's Pig and Anchor Barbecue Smokehouse. Let's take a look at the menu. We got championship pork butt, blue ribbon chicken, smoked beef, smoked and dewy sausage, mac daddy for the size, which is mac and cheese, scratch mad coleslaw, old school potato salad, collard greens, molasses, baked beans, award winning, bourbon brown sugar, all oh, these are the sauces, Kansas City, smoke and sweet, spicy sriracha barbecue, and Carolina tangy sweet heat. This sounds delicious. Okay, we got chicken, the pork, the greens, molasses beans, and the potato salad. Let's try this out. Okay, so we're at Guy's Pig Barbecue on Deck 5, Carnival Magic. I don't like the potato salad. Adam likes it. I think it's bland. I don't want to add salt though because I'm sure this meal is very salty as it is. The pork butt's good. Everything tastes really good. And there was no lime. I feel like a lot of people don't even know that this is here because I wouldn't have it. This is only open for sea days. So this will not be open again until Saturday. And it's Monday. Mm. Which sucks because it is good. Chicken. Really good. The chicken's good. Yeah. Oh, I didn't get the chicken. Oh, yeah. All right, so we're back from lunch and we're hanging in our room because it's raining this way if you can see behind me let me shut this turn this around Let's spin you guys this way there's a big rain cloud right up there and all the rain coming up if you go back this way it's clear skies over here all rain all around us it's wild looking we're, we're shipping off into it right now this should be really cool to see oh it's pouring and we're in it yep in the rain oh yeah it's coming down now that's wild check that out <laughs> wow Whoa! Look at all the rain down there. <laughs> all right, <laughs> I'll give you guys an update in a little bit. So let's go check out the deck outside in the front. To get to it, you have to go this way to a door. That looks like this. And it's got this round hole to go outside. So yeah, we'll go out there. Okay, so I'm outside on the front deck of deck six and seven, and it is extremely windy but it's so cool to be out here guys like if you get a chance to get out here get out of here check it out for a few minutes but it's extremely windy but the, the views the views are amazing you have to come out here if you get a chance so i'll walk you down really quick go this way Right now I am looking over the balcony into the mezzanine and up top is actually the outside where the water slides are which is really cool and then you have the I think that's the 12th and 11th deck yeah the 12th and the 11th deck right there 
Um, one's the Lido deck, and I don't remember the other deck name that brings you outside. Really cool. And then when we look down, all the way down here, they're actually playing music down there. They're always playing music there at specific times throughout the day, but every day there's some kind of band or DJ playing music. Um, they have the flag up right now because they're doing a tribute to support uh, military persons. But yeah, this is just a really cool spot to hang. And people watch others take the elevator. Really cool. All right, we're outside of Pizzeria El Capitano, Del Capitano, and I'm grabbing the teriyaki chicken pizza. But they do have margarita, fungi, pepperoni, quattro, formaggio, and prosciutto. That's my Amazon. But right now they have nothing. But it's all being freshly made in the back. Right back there. All right, here's what the teriyaki chicken looks like. This looks really good. Can't wait to dig in. Thank you. Fun guy. That's good. Oh, it's ready. Go get it. Okay, we finally got the seafood platter. This looks good. Calamari. Clams, french fries, I want to say shrimp, yep, fish, and then we got the oyster platter over here. Yep, can't wait to eat this. Okay, clam strips are good. Yeah, they are. Um, fries are good. Fries are good. They have a good, like, Cajun seasoning. Calamari's good. Shrimp's pretty good. The oysters are huge. But they're not good. But not the best. And again, being from New England, that's it's hard to you know go anywhere well, else like to get this. good seafood. I get that again. But they're dollar seventy-five per oyster. That's inexpensive, definitely. Very inexpensive. Yeah. So if you want oysters, try it. Not bad. Just not what the standard of oysters we're used to. So we're gonna eat dinner, and then we're gonna go explore the rest of the ship and see where the night takes us. Yeah, All right, I'm gonna play deal or no deal. Got my card right here. Hoping it called up. We'll see what happens. But right now we're just waiting for the game show to start. First number is one. What's it gonna be? Those are my numbers. I was close. That's all right. We still get to play. Five dollars. Good job. Who got a match? Hey. Oh, look at that. You're on your way, folks. Now, make sure that you are keeping track of your matches out there in the audience. Nine. 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 Let's lock in with this. What? You what? Nine, you sticking with that one? Guys, needs to be a dollar. Needs to be a dollar. All right, let's see. Let's lock in case number nine. Set. Oh! Oh! 